This is so hard because I'm such an honest person and it's so hard for me to do these kind of things. Angelina Jolie's not making her dating life a priority, seven years after filing for divorce from Brad Pitt. You know, it's that, what's that expression, it's how well you walk through the fire, but you walk through it. It feels powerful. The Oscar winner gets candid for WSJ Magazine, sharing updates about life, both personal and professional, along with words of wisdom for anyone going through a hard time. Go right through it. Like, right through it. Feel it. Be in it. Don't avoid it. Go completely in it. Feel everything. And then go right through it and get out the other end. Inside the mag, the 48-year-old star touches on her romantic prospects, admitting that she's not currently dating. In fact, I don't really have a social life. I think it's very important for us to appreciate life. While Angie doesn't reveal what she needs in a romantic partner, she does offer what she looks for in a collaborator. I think someone who's, who's bold and maybe a little, a little mad. A little, a little, mad. little bit of madness. I think while it's very important to be thoughtful and ethical and considerate, it is also very important to have a little madness, have a little wild. Of course, Angelina's tumultuous split from Brad played out in the spotlight. Stories often including their six children. We are just a family. Whom she now considers her close friends. We're seven very different people, which is our strength. I spend time with my kids and just to be around them because they're the best of me. And I've learned something from all of them differently and I think they're really interesting people, but I feel stronger when I'm with them. When your children are your best friends, it's kind of a, it's a nice life. Meanwhile, Angelina's latest role is quite the high note. Portraying famed opera singer Maria Callas on the big screen. I felt very, uh, very lucky. And while Angelina admits she was terrified to sing for the movie, that fear's all a part of her creative process. Let's get out of your head and be willing to make a fool of yourself. I love being a part of the entire process from beginning to end and dedicating years of my life to a story and and learning about it and um, and shepherding it all the way and even though it's a bit of a responsibility you feel a little pressure <laughs> but it's a welcome pressure because you you, you stand by something and um, I, I guess I like the responsibility. As Angelina focuses on her future she's finding inspiration in the past too. Well her past self that is. Oh so many things I'd like to warn her about. I think it's taken me a long time to get back to her. I didn't trust my madness. I didn't think it was a good thing when I was young, and I think it's a part of, it's a part of me, so it's important. I'm trying to find her again.